Hey guys, it's Joey. So Tony hasn't uploaded a video in almost a week. And yeah, he moved to a different city, changed his studio and all that is very stressful. But no video in a week? Come on, Tony. What's happening? Talk to the people here. And also, I want to get something started in the comments, guys. Hashtag bring Joey back. First of all, Joey, I told you not to edit my videos when I'm not there. That's why you got fired in the first place, okay? Second of all, what is up everyone, all my beautiful people out there? My name is Tony, and welcome back to my channel. So what the heck have I missed, man? E3 has been insane, I know I missed that. An Avengers game has been announced, a new Star Wars game has been announced, a single player Star Wars game, Watch Dogs, the third one, which I'm super excited about. Cyberpunk 2077, Seven with freaking Keanu Reeves? What is happening? Absolutely insane E3 this year, man. And I'll talk more about the games and what has been happening in E3 a little bit later. But yeah, I moved. I'm in my new studio right now and I wanted to talk just for a second, just for a quick second, talk about my new uploading schedule. Obviously, there will be videos every day until the end of this week, but starting from next week, you can expect videos on Tuesdays, Tuesdays, Friday, Saturday with a special video on Sunday every other week which would probably be an I killed video so that is the new uploading schedule and those are the days that you need to expect videos for me I'm gonna call it casual Tuesday maybe explosion Friday superpower Saturday where I explore superheroes and stuff because I kind of like superheroes and obviously I killed Sunday so that is my plan I want to See what you guys think about it in the comment section down below. Leave as many recommendations as you can think of, anything that you would like to see on this channel. And on other news, I don't feel bad anymore. I know that the title says I don't feel so good and I, I didn't feel so good, but I think I am back in my full element right now. At least I'm trying to be. I'm trying to get there in my full element where I'll be able to upload daily, but I'm not there yet, so that is why i have made this uploading schedule so it never comes to a burnout like that i have free days throughout the week where i can do whatever i want game uh, i started playing Elder scrolls online the other day and super fun so that's probably what i will do on my off days and on the, on the days where i actually do stuff i have i have prepared uh some games in advance that i want to play i want to play a lot more minecraft i want to play a lot more gmod a lot more of vr definitely vr is going to be a big big deal in the upcoming videos especially with I killed VR coming up and <laughs> that is going to be freaking insane but now I wanted to talk about some games that I've seen on E3 I've been following E3 even though I haven't sit down to watch it because of the moving and stuff I have been following the news on my phone so Nintendo announced Legend of Zelda 2 the sequel to Legend of Zelda which is also freaking insane I have been a massive fan of the Zelda series especially since the last game Breath of the Wild and this is a successor to Breath of the Wild and I cannot wait to get my hands on that game even though we only just got a little trailer no gameplay no nothing you already know it's going to be freaking amazing Then there's Watch Dogs. I have really enjoyed the first Watch Dogs, even though most people really didn't. I, I've been a huge fan of the first Watch Dogs in Chicago. The second one I didn't, didn't play, the one in San Francisco. I don't know why. A lot of people say that it's a much better game than the first one, and I liked the first one because of the gameplay mechanics and because it tried something new, you know, with the hacking and stuff. But the story was very, very weak in the first one, so I, I never really got around to playing the second one. But this third one looks absolutely insane! It's like set in a almost post-apocalyptic world where the government has abandoned its people and... There's chaos everywhere, factions building up, and you have to build a resistance to rise against the criminal underworld, and you can play as anyone, freaking an old woman, and it uh, just looks freaking great. It looks great. And obviously Cyberpunk 2077, I, I don't think there's really anything that I need to say about that game. It hasn't already been said. It's from the guys that made the Witcher series, which is one of my favorite series of all time. Like. After Elder Scrolls, the Witcher series is probably on my number two place. Deathloop 
has been announced, which is a game by Arcane Studios, the guys who made Dishonored 1 and 2, and I'm a massive fan of Dishonored, so I'm really looking forward to this game. I don't really know anything about it, ex except that it has a similar look and kind of feel to Dishonored, where you have your magic abilities, you have the leaping and stuff, and it just has that Dishonored vibe, which I really like. As for the Avengers game, I don't really think there's anything we can really say there because we didn't get a gameplay, we just got a trailer. And people are not satisfied with the trailer because those are not the Avengers that they're used to. It's not the Tony Stark, you know, it's not Robert Downey Jr., obviously, since this is a game. But it's something I really like. So, even in the new Spider-Man game, the Marvel Spider-Man on PS4, you don't play as Tom Holland, you just play as Peter Parker, the video game Peter Parker. Which is something that Square Enix has also done with Avengers, and I, I, I expected that. So, I, I don't really know why people got confused, why people didn't like that. For me personally, I like that they're not the same as in the movie. Because if they were the same, I would just think it's another movie adaptation game, and those always suck. So you'll be able to play as Thor, as Iron Man, as Hulk, as Black Widow, and Captain America. And I'm, I missed someone, didn't I? Someone's missing. Hmm. Hawkeye. Yeah, no word from Hawkeye. He is probably happy with his family somewhere out in the woods. He doesn't want to deal with the Avengers BS. <laughs> I love E3, I've been a big fan of E3 since forever, just like every other gamer, and you know, deep in my heart, I am still a very, very passionate gamer. So with all that being said and done, thank you so much for watching this video, it was a short update to let you know what will be happening in the near future on this channel, you can get excited for the first ever Explosion Friday, or maybe Bang Friday, I don't, I don't even know what I'm gonna call it yet, but I'll think of something. But anyway, I'll see you tomorrow. Until then, my name is Tony. Bye-bye and stay awesome. Bye.